Hey guys, Metal Knight here, and today I am previewing the champion Lucian. Um, this is Lucian's skin, if you guys haven't uh, seen it yet. Um, which is actually a really nice skin. Um, I really like it. Uh, so first of all, I'm going to show you his uh, joke, taunt, and all those things. And then after that, I am going to show you um, his skills. Uh, just note that he just came out around 30 minutes ago. So I may not be getting the right skill order, but I'm still going to give you guys my thoughts and things like that. Um, so I'm just going to be quiet so I, you guys could hear his taunt, his joke, and all that. <laughs> and they say I have a grim sense of humor. This is my happy face. See? No, really. I am smiling. Death is a mercy. And I have enough mercy to go around. Death at the door? <laughs> no. I am the one who knocks. I'll have no trouble killing you. And less trouble killing you again. That is such a weak laugh. <laughs> Anyways, um, so the, that's his taunt, his laugh and all that. And now I'm going to talk about his abilities. So the first thing is his passive. Uh, after every spell, Lucian's next basic attack within 6 seconds will be a double shot. The second shot deals 56 damage. Minions and monsters take full damage from the second shot. So that's his passive. Um, his Q shoot, shoots a bolt of piercing light through an enemy unit, damaging enemies in a line for 200 damage plus 105 bonus attack damage. Physical damage uh, deals half damage to minions, so I'm just going to show you that. And that it, there it is. Um, so basically it's a beam. Um, also I just want to talk about his auto attack animation since he is an AD carry. I think it's really smooth. For most AD carries, I enjoy it a lot. Really nice. Um, then his uh, W is... I shouldn't mention the names, which is Light Slinger, Piercing Light. His W, Ardent Blaze. Uh, fires a shot that explodes uh, upon enemy contact or reaching the end of its path. The explosion deals that damage, magic damage, and marks enemies for 6 seconds. Dealing uh, damaging marked targets grants Lucian 45 movement speed for 2 seconds. Also, uh, I would like to mention that I can't just Q anything, right? That I can, this I can't. My Q I can't, my W I can. Um, I don't know why they did it like that. I guess they didn't want his beam to be a skill shot. Even though it still is. Like, it still has that huge delay. Um, for it to be a skill shot. Anyways, his E is really weird. Because I've never seen an E literally do nothing other than displace the your champion, right? Because, um... If you look at, for example, Corky's W, which is also sort of like the C, which is it displaces you, it moves you, um, that leaves behind the trail of fire, which does damage. This ability, though, doesn't do anything except remove slowing effects. I'm not saying it's bad, I'm saying it's different. Um, also, uh, if Culling kills, which is this, his ultimate is called Culling, if that kills the enemy champion, it resets the cooldown of E. So you could theoretically E in, alt, and then E back out, and his E is basically that, which is really cool. Um, also, if you notice, it's he's very run and gun, 
which I find really cool because it's very different. Um, finally, his ultimate. I'm not going to show it off right now. Uh, I'm going to show it off once we get into a fight, me and uh, Umbral Invoker. Right, since we both haven't died yet. He is really beating me in CS though because I'm talking, but whatever. Um, his ultimate is the culling. Lucian moves freely, firing a single in a single target for 6 seconds. His shots collide and they deal specific amounts of damage. The number of shots scale with his attack speed, that's really cool. Total damage over 15 shots is 919. The culling does 300 damage to minions. Uh, Lucian may use Relentless Pursuit during calling, so that's really cool, his E. And reactivate the calling to cancel early. Basically how you should think of this is an MF, an MF alt, but um, instead of it just keeping MF in place, you could move freely. Um, so let's talk about skill order. Also, I have 113 AD if you want to try to do the math on that for his skills, showing them one last time. Uh, I assume it's max Q, then max W, then max E last, though his W is very strong, right? So I don't know if maybe his, uh, maybe you'll max his W first? I, I have no clue. I know you're not going to max his E first. I'm also getting my ass kicked. Um, so yeah, that's Lucian, I hope you guys liked it, um, I'm just going to try to kill him once or twice, I'm probably not going to be able to, but we could try. Um, and that'll be all for this video. I also wish, I also wish this guy had picked the other Lucian skin, but um, yeah, he's, he's really cool. Oh my god, that auto attack is so strong. That is a lot of damage. Um if you land that. So maybe you're gonna have to max that first actually. And there was his ultimate. Uh, in a minute I'm gonna show his ultimate one last time. Uh, but this time I'm going to be much more zoomed in. So you guys can see it. Awesome. I really do enjoy him. Um, he's very... He's very different from the AD carries. I know that people will probably say, oh, it's just another same thing, right? But I think that there, he's, he's going to have so much potential if they don't make him way too weak. and these are my skills and I'll be back up in 10 seconds and I'm gonna try to show how him running and gunning looks like all right so I'm gonna adjust. actually I'm gonna use it on this guy I'm gonna zoom in a tiny bit and I'm gonna actually show it on this guy I can't zoom in too much yeah, um, <laughs> wow, 
I... I don't know if I, I love his ultimate or I hate it because it's very... You can't... Like, okay, let's talk about his ultimate for a second. Because... It's both love and hate, right? MF's ultimate... I, I'm gonna compare it to MF's ultimate primarily because there isn't much of a difference. The only difference is one doesn't lock you in place, one does lock you in place, and one has a much bigger... Um, and one has a much bigger, um, what can I say? One has a much bigger cone of area, while Everybody this one is a very, like, line-based thing. I have 17 shots. Um... You get attack speed from levels. Um, anyways. So, MF Salt locks you in place, right? And that's really good. Because it's a really strong ultimate. Now, on the other hand, Lucian's ultimate doesn't lock you in place. But, if you can't properly manage that ultimate, you're going to have problems. Like, if you noticed, he was able to ult get much more ult shots on me than I was on him. Also, I, I think Black Cleaver... Does Black Cleaver? I'd assume Black Cleaver scales on, on the amount of shots that you're doing. So, that might also be a reason why he did so well. So I'm gonna wait till this uh, finishes and I'm gonna try to get into a fight with him. I wasn't able to see if my armor went down from um, the attack speed. Let me actually ask this guy. Does Black Cleaver... What, what's it called? Passive? Executed. Also, I didn't really talk about his dying animation, but you guys got to see it. Um, so yeah, that's basically Lucian in a nutshell. So we're actually going to test out if Black Cleaver works on his ultimate, and after that I'm actually going to call it and end the video. Spirit of the Lizard Elder is so nerfed right now. I hope that they sort of buff it, but not too much. But they had to nerf it, because the, the, the cost efficiency was stupid. Oh my god, it does. Oh my god, that's so good. Also, he has a lot of base armor. I don't know if you guys noticed, but his base armor is 66. I don't know if um, other AD carries have that high base armor. I'm gonna have to check that. But, um, yeah. Anyways, I hope you guys have enjoyed uh, this little preview of Lucian. And I'll see you guys next time. Later, guys.